So the chances are by having pressed on this video, you want to learn how to create vertical text in Adobe Photoshop. And by that, I don't mean creating horizontal text and free transforming it into a vertical position. Actually, what we want to be able to do is type text in a vertical manner. So in this video, what we're going to do is learn the three different ways we can type text vertically in Adobe Photoshop. So when we have Adobe Photoshop open, the first thing we want to do is actually type out our text. And in order to do this, what we can do is use a tool called the type tool. And the shortcut to the type tool is the letter T, and it's always handy to know your shortcuts so that you don't have to go around finding the tools that you actually need. So as you can see, I pressed the letter T on my keyboard and I've now automatically switched to the type tool in Photoshop. And the easiest way to tell this is because the parameters have changed at the top as well as our cursor, which is now displaying a different icon. So if we just press once anywhere on our screen using our left mouse button, we can draw out some text. Now I'm actually going to confirm this text by just pressing the tick at the top of our parameters here. Now, as you can see, we have our horizontal text and we know it's horizontal because it's been typed from left to right. So like I said, we don't want to actually change our text by just pressing Command and T in order to bring it into free transform and then just hold Shift and actually snap it to the vertical axis. And as you can see, that technically is text written in a vertical manner. But what we want is to have this vertical alignment, but with the text still facing the right way around so we can actually read it. So if I just quickly press Command and Z in order to undo that, so there's actually a few different ways we can bring our text into that vertical alignment. So the first way to do it is just to select all of the text and then go to the top left hand corner of the parameters until you see this small icon here. And just by pressing that once, as you can see, it's now going to bring our text into a vertical alignment, but we can actually still read the text itself. Now, another way to be able to do that, if I just quickly press Command and Z, is if we actually go to the layer on the layers panel itself. So with the layers panel selected, we can find the text object that we created, which is this layer right here. By right clicking on it, we can actually go to the vertical option. And just by pressing that once, it's also going to bring our text into vertical alignment. Now, lastly, what we can also do is actually create the text object from a vertical type tool. So in order to do that, what we need to do is actually find the type tool itself, which is on the left hand toolbar right here. As you can see, it's automatically set to the horizontal type tool. But in order to actually go to the vertical type tool itself, what we need to do is hold on the type tool. And as you can see, we get a drop down with a few different options. So we want the second option right here, which is the vertical type tool. And just by releasing on that, our cursor once again changes. It's almost rotated by 90 degrees. And just by pressing once anywhere on our screen, we can now create a new text object, which is automatically in vertical alignment. So as you can see, those are the three different ways you can actually align your text vertically in Adobe Photoshop. If you're interested in learning how you can actually write text in different shapes, then do check out the video on the right of the end screen. And otherwise, if you'd be interested in becoming a member of the channel, which gives you early access and some extra perks, then do consider checking out the link to join in the video description below.